so this is the secundo part to the polka. So we have the polka with the primo part is the high part, and it's the part that usually the student's going to play in this case. But then there's a teacher part, or the secundo part, but you may or may not be a teacher. Hmm. I'm mean to my students, aren't I? So I want to try to have my students play these duets, especially one like this in the literature book. So, you get the teacher part. Let me break it down for you. We have this crazy little chord right here, but you want to know what type it is. Let me figure it out. A diminished 7, half diminished 7. Yep, fully diminished 7. The C in the bass, yeah, there you go. So C7, the A diminished, so C7. Okay. Um, weird little thing, just practice the right hand, you'll see how it fits. And then we go into a big retardando I would do, and then we start the actual piece. Da -da -da. bars that I played, that would be a good phrase to practice. They're really related. They have the F chord to the G minor chord, and um, and then that C7 thing, but they're really similar the way they work map. So practice that in a set like that. Uh, you may want to try the right hand, figure out your chords. We have a lot of flats, but kind of all in the same place. So work that out. The B section, a little bit different. A little more powerful, and we have different chords. I would do two bars at a time on this one. So you have C chord, E diminished to D minor chord. So practice that right hand first, and then the left hand just walking up chromatically. The next one, F chord, F minor chord, G chord, G7, G C chord. about what chords you're playing, it'll make it much easier to figure out what notes are there. Okay? So practice two bars at a time there. And then the next two bars are this. It looks familiar if you play the beginning. It's the same as the other beginning. And then we have the C chord, G7. And then the little DS Alfine. This part right here, tricky. In fact, whenever I practiced it, I played it a couple days before this. I messed that part up because I didn't staccato. Do you want to learn from the video? Staccato this. Much easier. If you hold your hand down, it doesn't really work. And then you're back to measure five. It's a fun one. You get to be a teacher. Enjoy the life. You're me now. 